Hello people, Edwin Lerner back once again. In this YouTube astrological segment I'm going to be dissertating and talking about Jupiter in Libra. Uh, people with this placement may receive um, some kind of um, my fortune, uh, might be art connected with I guess we could say artistic endeavors, um, you know music, something, um, you know, creative creative fields, the law, uh, partnerships, relationship, uh, you know, marriage could be somewhat uh, providential for them. Jupiter and Libra may abhor injustice and desires fairness in everything. These people like equilibrium in a relationship and generally don't like a domineering partner. Jupiter and Libra is open to new philosophies and ideas, concepts, especially in connection with partnerships. With this placement, you could be expansive, idealistic, diplomatic, and fair-minded. These people also can be selfless, magnanimous, and have a humanitarian urge. Jupiter and Libra may put a strong emphasis on what is ethical, moral, and scrupulous. Their strong ability to reconcile and mend relationships can make them excellent mediators and marriage counselors. Some careers that may be suitable for these people include music, art, singing, uh, a counselor, and the science fields. People um, with this placement, despite uh, being very uh, peace-loving and passive, uh, perhaps, they will generally fight for their beliefs when necessary. Some famous people with Jupiter and Libra, singing legend icon Madonna, renowned founder of analytical psychology Carl Jung, actor Charles Bronson, Italian fashion designer uh, Giorgio Armani, and the venerable researcher slash explorer slash scientist Jacques Cousteau. I should say Jacques Cousteau, I guess. Well, people, that will conclude this YouTube astrological segment for Jupiter and Libra, and in the next segment, I will be talking about Jupiter and Scorpio. And um, I want to get with you on a couple things before I head out. The stars impel, they do not compel. And secondly, never isolate any one astrological aspect, element, configuration, planetary placement, or what have you, and make an analysis on a person astrologically based on that because there are so many elements and components in a horoscope that make up the person, not just one. Well, that'll do it, people. Until next time, stay well.